Governor Abbott made a disaster declaration today in an effort to fight against the spread of the coronavirus. This allows state resources to be moved around to make getting help easier. As of right now, Texas has 39 confirmed cases spread across 10 counties in the state. He spoke to the public today to address concerns. From the very start, the state of Texas anticipated the possibility of community spread of COVID-19. Surrounded by a team of officials who've been dealing with coronavirus since at least January, Governor Abbott assured people the state has been preparing for various possible scenarios. On January the 31st, DSHS activated the State Medical Operations Center. Last week, DSHS announced that 10 public health labs in Texas are now equipped to perform COVID-19 testing throughout the state. Working with school and health care providers, DSHS has been on several calls with local health officials and school districts. Texas is seeking waivers for federal regulations for the school lunch program to give districts flexibility to provide students food should the district need to shut down. The state is also addressing concerns about health insurers. Now the state has also asked health insurers and HMOs operating in Texas to waive costs associated with the testing and telemedicine visits concerning coronavirus. If an uninsured person needs testing for coronavirus, there are two options, public health testing or private laboratory testing. The governor then held up a list of those providers willing to comply and said that uninsured people needing tests need to consult with public health departments and their test would come at no cost to them. Texas public health labs have the capacity to test 273 people per day currently. And the first drive through testing facility in Texas is open in San Antonio. It will initially be for first responders, health care workers, operators of critical infrastructure, and key resources and certain high-risk patients. Governor Abbott is also in talks with other major cities in Texas to provide that kind of facility. He also noted the state's disaster declaration authorizes various directives to take place in the coming days. I'm directing state agencies to provide flexible work and telework policies to employees to give them the ability to care for their families while ensuring the state government continues to function at full capacity and provide all necessary services. And Governor Abbott also wanted to stress Texans should be doing their part to ensure their neighbors' safety too. There's absolutely no need to go out and stockpile supplies. There will be plenty available. We're going to make it through this. We've been through situations like this before, and we're going to make it through this together as well. If you want to see Governor Abbott's full press conference, find out more about how the state is handling COVID-19, or how to find low or no-cost health care providers, just visit our website at kxtv.com.